guys, Jay here, back with another video, and I'm super excited for this unboxing. And this is, of course, going to be your iPhone X uh, in silver. I did opt for the 64GB uh, variant, as you see up here. And just, of course, taking a look around the box, you have your iPhone X, silver color-matched iPhone branding and Apple logos, and... Sadly, I did have to get this activated at Best Buy, because that's where I bought it. So they already opened it up. But I, luckily, I didn't transfer any of my settings at Best Buy. So let's go ahead and see, see it. And of course, before we get started, we have our Design by Apple in California. I'm sorry, I'm just super excited, I can't even talk. We have our Hello Quick Start Guide which is, oops, you might need this, because there's new gestures and there's no home button. We have our SIM ejector tool, which I know they don't sell a, um, sell a SIM free model, but they made me put a Verizon SIM card in, so that was pretty odd. I thought it would already come with one, especially if you already watched my iPhone 8 Plus unboxing, that one already came with a Verizon SIM. But again, I ordered that through Verizon. So here is the star of the show. Of course, it's already turned on. Uh, I did opt for the silver one, and as you see, the plastic wrap on it right now is just collecting uh, fingerprints. But the actual phone will be collecting way more fingerprints than that. We have our 5 watt power adapter. Of course, no fast charging. Apple's very cheap. Our ear pods, lightning connector to headphone jack adapter, and our lightning cable which I just dropped so let's go ahead and focus on the phone so let's go ahead and set up the iPhone 10 so since it's an OLED panel you can just touch the screen to wake it up so swipe up to open English United States and I'm gonna go ahead and do this quick start feature so here I bring my old iPhone 6 you see it says no sim and here it is set up new iPhone unlock to continue Continue. So I will aim this into that pattern thing. So I have to go ahead and enter the passcode of my other phone. So it's going to go ahead and set up the phone, activating. So I'm going to go ahead and set up Face ID on my new phone. So click continue. So you just have to move your uh, face in a circle. So here I am. Okay. Okay, Face ID is set up. Sorry you couldn't see that. But I'm pretty sure you saw like, way more unboxings already on YouTube. So I'm going to go ahead and agree to the terms and conditions. So I am gonna go ahead and restore my phone from an iTunes backup. So let me go ahead and quickly do that. I did go ahead and get it restored. So let's go ahead and swipe up. Face ID. Restore was completed. Continue, I'll go ahead and connect it to my Wi-Fi. It's gonna go ahead and update all of its little settings and stuff. Enable location services. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna set up later in wallet my Apple Pay. I'm not gonna do any iCloud storage. I'm gonna go ahead and set up Siri, but do that later. I'm gonna use True Tone. So these are the new um, setup menus in the iPhone 10, which tell you how to use the gestures within uh, iOS 11. So you have to swipe up to go home. Continue. To switch between your synapse, you just move your uh, finger on the bottom slider. Quickly access controls, you're going to go ahead and swipe up from that corner. And that's it. So we are back into this. and all I did go ahead and choose one of the uh, black backgrounded wallpapers. This is the dynamic one. So it's really cool. The colors really pop. And the blacks are you know, truly black since it's an OLED display. All you see, all my apps are currently installing. So here's the control center, notification center. 
so stay tuned for more videos. I'll do a lot more on my iPhone 10. So thanks for watching, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.